What's good? What's good? Q to Fridays, Q to Fridays, Q to Fridays. Come get these gems. Come get these life tips. Any, anything and everything, I feel like that is very, very important for when it comes to a person growth in many ways. Q to Fridays. That's what it is. You know what I'm saying? So this week's topic is called not everything that you do in business has to be for money or not every, not everything that you do when it comes to business have it has to deal with money or getting paid for it and, you know it was a very very like um random topic that I came up with but at the same time I feel like it's very very important because um when when it comes down to you know whenever you approach a person about like a business opportunity or it's like business period or you have to pretty much just be a part of a business and that kind of stuff. Like for a certain amount of time, like I don't feel like it has, has like the money aspect of things have a major impact on it. You know what I'm saying? Um, so my thoughts on this entire thing is um, I've done a lot of things with business, with other people and that, and that kind of stuff. Didn't get paid a dime. All right. But you could have got paid a different way, you know? Exposure um, is a huge thing. Why? Because now, let's say if you did, a, I went to go speak at a person's event or that kind of thing, right? Didn't get paid for it, that kind of thing. Cool. But at the same time, I impacted people. I got my name out there. I got, this got, overall, it's gotten more exposure by people that at times don't even know me, which is perfectly fine because now you're growing that network that you know, is there for the taking, you know, like you're actually getting tapped into a network that you never had before. Like all these things are just different types of value that you can pretty much get compared to, to always the monetary value. You're gaining value. Um, yeah, just putting your name out there. It's like getting your face familiar with everybody else. That goes a long way, you know, and now all of a sudden like that, this class of, of people seeing you and now all of a sudden, um, you know, you go to a state where that, 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 that person actually lives and all of a sudden you have, you have all these connections based off of just that one interaction that you had at that class that you never got paid for. You know, like to me, that's, that's worth everything because, um, it goes a long way. Like you can meet this one person and then all of a sudden, since you did this for this other person, then it puts you with good graces with this other person and, and so on and so on and so on and so on. It's a trickle effect, which is pretty cool too, because, um, you know, even building friendships at times, like, you know, and it has to deal with a little bit of business. You're going to do favors, whatever, you know, like, I, I feel like even if it's not for the exposure, even if it's for just the support of a person's brand, like that also is value that you're putting out there and value that you're getting back because now you know, you are adding value, which is can also be a, a very, very fulfilling feeling also when it comes to giving to somebody else versus always trying to receive from everybody else, you know? Um, I feel like after a while, you actually, you kind of get, you don't really get as fulfilled when it comes to gaining stuff because you're so, you probably already used to gaining a bunch of stuff. So when it comes time for, you know, just giving value or just giving your time or just giving just like anything dealing with yourself to another person that could pretty much benefit in some kind of way. Like even, you know, like I said before, like going to speak at, speak at an event, speak at a class, speak, speak to others that pretty much, you know, get to know you like, yo, you're changing lives just like that. Cause now you just pretty much just altered their entire mindset. You, you altered how they, how they thought about something that they weren't really too sure about. And now, you know, you kind of just tweak their mind a little, little bit just so they see your perspective a bit more and just became a bit more open to that opportunity or that, you know, whatever you were explaining about, they, they are now more alert about that. So that alone is, um, is a fulfilling type of thing I crave at times because, you know, there, there's times that, you know, I've, I've been doing like what I do for so long already. There's certain things that just get boring, you know, certain things just, just get boring. Um, 
making money is cool, but it does get boring. If you get if you're used to doing something for so long and that kind of stuff, it's gonna get boring. Like and that's it's that way with with everything. But at the same time, when you start to shift how you're giving off that value now, like it's more fulfilling. Watching someone else grow based off of your efforts that you just gave a helping hand to, to push whatever they have going on a lot more, that's just as worth it. Because now you're you're seeing what you used to enjoy and seeing how another person is in, enjoying it based on what you know, how that feeling is. You know what I'm saying? It's like that, that feeling that you love to feel, you're seeing a, another person experience that same feeling. And that feeling is... Um, it just makes you just laugh inside, like, oh my God, like, yeah, this is so fucking dope just to see this person, you know, happy and excited for something that is regular to you now, you know? So overall, just don't be so craving for just the monetary value because some people will just, let's say, post or give you um, some money for doing an event, but never call you back again, you know what I'm saying? Or just never really try to interact with you too, too much again. But by all means, everyone sees how different this topic can actually be. But I feel like when it comes to really, really having a, a dope ass friendship with a little bit of business and that kind of stuff, like a, a favor here and there that doesn't even cost a person anything is at times the, the best thing that, that a person can ever, ever ask for. Because once they actually know that you're willing to go that route for them, then you know, they're gonna, they're more than likely going to be feeling that same exact way in return, you know? And once that is reciprocated on both parts, I feel like the, um, the, the bond just kind of grows to bigger opportunities and like bigger ventures. And they pretty much understand like how you come off and like the kind of value that you plan on bringing based off of you not really craving anything, but eventually it's going to have come to a point that, you know, the money's going to be a question, but at the same time, don't be afraid to just reach out, reach out, give your value because there's somebody that could actually benefit. Even if it's not monetary at this moment in time, you're still getting your face out there. You're still getting exposure. You're still getting, you know, just people familiar with how, how you look and how you carry yourself and your personality and all these things that they're probably questioning the entire time. But just you taking time out of your day just to give that value to somebody else and not ask for anything in return. That's that means everything. That means everything. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much my Q-tip Fridays for this week right here. Just and not everything that you do in business have to be for money. It's a lot more that can 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 come out of it. There's a lot more that can come out of it, but you have to just be open to just giving more than just always trying to receive on every single transaction. You know what I'm saying? So just be very open, like when it comes down to it, because there's a lot of people that have lots to offer that um can't offer money every single time or at first, you know? So I'm going to see you guys on Q2 Fridays next week. Peace out. Have a good weekend.